Nico, the derby is just around the corner. Tomorrow is the day. Do you already feel any tension? Uh, yes, absolutely. Um, but it's mostly uh, exciting. Um, this is the game that everyone uh, is speaking about and uh, we are looking forward to it. Yeah, I think uh, you can feel it throughout the week and um, even in the weeks building up to the game and you know, especially today, um, you can feel everybody's just uh, you know, buzzing to, for it to start. You witnessed two derbies against HSV. Um, what makes these derbies so special? Oh, I think like any, der any derby, the, um, the feeling it's about the, the energy in the city and the energy within the, within the fans, in the stadium, in the streets. I think that's what brings the fire to the players. And um, you know, we have to feed off that and, and use it to try and get three points. Personally, what does uh, this derby mean to you? Uh, this is not my first derby, but before each one, um, exciting. It's, it's uh, pretty the same, maybe even more this time. Um, it's a special feeling to be a part of it. We know that as players, these are the games that you want to play in, um, you know, the biggest games in, in the season, so everyone's looking forward to it. There was a defeat after 10 wins uh, last week. How did the team come to term with the defeat and did you do anything differently this week? Yeah, we knew that uh, defeat, uh, it, uh, it had to come, but we didn't expect it to be this way. We were really disappointed after the game, but now we need to focus on the next game and try to um, learn from mistakes from the previous one. How do you rate uh, Haasfeld's team in uh, general? I would say they are a pretty balanced team with a lot of uh, uh, strong individuals and uh, I think it will be open game. Yeah, obviously there's a reason they've been at the, near the top of the table for most of the season. Um, they have great quality, um, but you know we, we feel we can, we can match that and um, obviously we'll look at our game plan of how to stop their threats, but mainly focus on ourselves because we know that when we, when we play at our best, we can, we can beat anybody. You're going to have 50,000 uh, people against you tomorrow. You often played uh, in front of such big crowds. Uh, what is the best way to deal with this? I think, um, you know, just calmness and composure is always the, is, is the best way to deal with that situation. But I think also you need to feed off that energy as well and, and make sure you take it in. And I think sometimes we... As footballers, you get caught up in an occasion or in a game and you don't have a chance to really look around and soak it all in. So in those little moments that you get, I think you have to uh, take in that energy, feed off it and, and use it to, to lift your own performance. Okay, good luck and see you tomorrow.